Those wheels have a mind of their own. I need you to spearhead the September cover shoot. Thank you. <laughs> I know you've been wanting to get your hands on a cover for quite some time. Now's your chance. If Brandon doesn't like the cover, I'm never going to hear the end of it. We broke up like six months ago. Six months isn't a long time when your ex is also your boss. Hi. Oh. You know what, it's fine. You, you take it. Maybe one of the most uninspiring covers I have ever seen. Someone actually put a lot of effort into making that cover. Brandon got engaged. I'm actually seeing someone new myself. Mm -hmm. Mm. Him! That guy right there in your office? Come here! Oh. Nate Taylor. You were named promising new photographer by the New York Times. I thought it would be fun if we can shoot in a sumptuous hotel lobby. No, don't like it. We will make She Magazine more relevant than it has ever been. Absolutely not. I want vivid and inspiring. Shooting in studio actually allows us to be more creative. I was thinking a 1930s mood. I just hope your boyfriend here isn't pushing you in directions you'd normally think twice about. You pretended I was your boyfriend. Do you think you'd consider going along with it? Yeah, I'll do it. I hate having my picture taken. The camera certainly doesn't hate you. Where's Darcy going? Party with her boyfriend. Well, thank you for today. I mean, everything 10 times easier. Surprise. I'm really good at this fake boyfriend thing. I've come up with a perfect concept for the cover. We use actual readers. All four of you look fantastic, by the way. You ladies are going to be an inspiration to women all over the country. You never stop thinking about work. That's not strictly true. Something else on your mind? May I present the September cover? Your cover completely missed the mark. I should have never complicated things. By involving me in this ridiculous fake boyfriend scheme? No, you shouldn't. Nate is good for you. I haven't seen you this happy in years. I'm worried that I've gone and messed it all up. Thanks to you, I remembered why I love photography in the first place.